Hi guys, we had an idea of creating a glove box that could be easily disassembled and assembled back and placed in any place of your preference. For this project we will require a sheet of cardboard which will be used to make a template for cutting our acrylic sheet and the acrylic sheet itself which is 5 mm thick. First we will create our cardboard template and see how it assembles in the enclosure of our preference and then we lay out our acrylic accordingly. Then we go ahead and cut everything. And the best way to cut the acrylic is to use the circular saw for wood. We'll set the depth of cut to 7 or 10 millimeters and place a sheet of wood laminate or under acrylic sheet. Then we simply proceed according to the template. When the cutting is done, the cutting edges needs to be polished and folded, but we were not really sure if our project would be successful, so we put off this procedure up until the end. Now let's get to bending our acrylics, and for this purpose we'll need to make a little device which will allow us to fold the acrylic sheets. We will need a piece of wood laminate, a few wooden blocks, a piece of nichrome wire, a few screws, a little spring, and a dimmable socket. First of all we'll take any automatic pen and take out the spring. And now where can we get the nichrome wire? We had an old iron, but you can get an old blow dryer or a broken heater or simply buy a piece of wire on eBay. We'll take a small paper clip and turn it into the loop so it will be able to control the tension of our Nikron wire. So it's two screws, a paper clip loop, a Nikron wire and we are almost ready. Now we'll screw down two wooden blocks along our nichrome wire in order to control our acrylic sheets. We will attach our nichrome wire to one of the screws. We will attach the wires from our dimmable socket to our nichrome wire. Then we will set the minimal power and switch everything on. We will increase the power until the nichrome wire becomes red. Then we will place our acrylic sheet so that our fold is right above the nichrome wire. Just let the acrylic sheet rest for 2 minutes after bending acrylic. Fix the sheet so that it solidifies with the proper angle. Then repeat the process as much as you require. After bending, we'll start polishing. We'll need several sandpapers, abrasive paste and a piece of felt. We'll start sanding our acrylic and we'll progress from the lower grade to higher grade. 500 grade, then 1000 grade, then 2000 grade, and then we'll polish with the abrasive paste and the felt. You can use any fine abrasive paste, but we had a piece of Soviet abrasive paste and we mixed it with a little bit of oil. Then fixed our felt to the cordless drill and continued the polishing. After that, we'll need to wash our acrylic with the soap. And now all that remains is to fix the gloves. This is the glove box after all. For this purpose we used the butyl rubber gloves which are used to deal with the chemicals and are relatively inexpensive. Now how do you fix the gloves? You can make the adapters out of any Tupperware that you have around. We will cut the bottom away from the from the vessel, insert it into the glove and glue everything nicely. Now we will install our box into the enclosure of our preference 
or the secret spot of your preference. And that's it. It's all done. Please like the video, subscribe to our channel, and in a week we will publish a new video for you.